Question 6. A plane meets the coordinate axis in ABC such that centroid of the triangle ABC is the point PQR. Show that equation of the plane is x by p plus y by q plus z by r. So it is given that the plane meet the coordinate axis in points A, B and C. Let's assume the point A, B on x axis and point A, B, sorry, one second, point A, B, A, B, A, 0, 0 and B, B, 0, B, 0 and C, B, 0, 0, C. So, equation of a plane uh, passing, making, uh, making intercepts A, B, and C respectively are is given by sorry respectively is given by we have discussed this already it is given by x by a plus y by b plus z by c is equal to 1 this is the equation of the plane making intercept a b and c um, so we have this. Now it is given that the centroid of the triangle ABC is point PQR. What is centroid of the triangle? So centroid of the triangle ABC uh, that is okay. This next triangle formed by A zero 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 B zero and zero zero C is given by um, A plus zero plus zero by three, which is A by three, and zero plus B plus zero by three, which is B by three, and zero plus zero plus C by three which is um, c by 3. So, equation, uh, how this we got centroid as this is discussed in the concept video that I did for the analytic geometry. So, you can check that out if you, if you are unfamiliar with this formula. So, a by 3, b by 3 and c by 3. Now, it is given that uh, a by 3, b by 3 and c by 3 is nothing but uh, p, q and r. So, that is a equal to 3p, b equal to 3q and c equal to 3r now let this be equation 1 and this be 2 okay using 2 in 1 we get x by a is 3p 3p plus y by 3q plus z by 3r equal to 1 or we can move all everything uh, 3 to the this side so that plus x by p plus y by q plus z by r is equal to 3 so this is the final equation so this is the solution to question 6 so in exam hall if this question comes for a larger mark, you can prove this part that the equation of a plane making intercept A, B, C is this equation. This this is uh, this you can prove uh, rather than stating it like this, you can prove this equation. So proving this is simple. So you can assume a general uh, 
general equation and put a0 0, 0 and 0 b0 0 and 0 0 c and you will get this equation so yeah so this is the solution to question 6 these are the steps